What's up gangsters? Uh, today's tutorial I'm going to show you how to speed up, slow down, or play your clip backwards with the use of Velocity Envelope in Sony Vegas 14. Uh, and this actually applies to any Sony Vegas. I, I, think, I think the first one I ever had was 8, so it goes back to at least 8, I know that for a fact. So it should work in any Sony Vegas version that you're using of Sony Vegas. Uh, the first thing you want to do is you want to make sure the clip is highlighted and uh, go into it, right click it, go down to where it says insert, remove envelope, and then scroll over or uh, move your pointer over velocity. And you'll see here it adds this line. What that is, that's your velocity envelope. Um, to, manipulate, to manipulate the speed, you can either move this line up or down. Um, you can either drag the whole line up like that to speed it up or down. Uh, and it shows you in that little pop-up window what the percentage is. So if you want to, uh, if you if you don't if you've moved it and you need to get it back to where it's at, you just right-click and reset it, and it moves it back to normal speed. Um, by doing what I just showed you, it'll adjust the whole clip. Now there's also a way where you can adjust the speeds within the clip to speed it up at a certain portion of the clip, and then bring it back down, and that you can do by inserting these little markers along the line and dragging just the markers up. So if you see here what I've done is I've sped up the video in just a clip, a portion of the clip, and then brought it back down. Um, so that's, that's a way of just doing, um, increasing the speed for just a portion and then bring it back down to normal with the use of these markers. And when you drag the markers down, it'll play the clip backwards. So if you go down below the 100% marker, now your clip starts to go in reverse. Um, there's also another way. If you want to add the audio, you want the audio to do the same thing that the video is doing, hit Shift. Make sure you highlight the video, hit Shift, highlight the audio, and uh, your changes will apply to the audio clip as well. Okay. One other way to do this is if you want to change the speed to the whole clip and you want to do it kind of quick without adding a velocity envelope, if you put your cursor over the end of the clip here where it shows the arrow pointing both ways, hold your control button down and now drag that clip out. Once you, when you drag it out, it's going to slow the clip down. When you drag it in and shorten it, it's going to speed the clip up. The, the whole clip is still going to be there when you do this. You're not adding to the clip or subtracting. You're just changing the speed. Where normally if you don't hold the control key and you're doing this, you're taking away from the clip, if that makes sense. And right there, you, you're probably familiar with that little gray uh, marker there at the end. So you know right there is the end of my clip. Uh, so it's pretty easy. Uh, if you got any questions, I'm not sure. I, I don't think I missed anything on this. But if you have any questions, go ahead and... Uh, Put it in the comments section. If you've liked this video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and subscribe. I'll be doing more Sony Vegas tutorials in the future. Um, if you didn't like the video, I don't really care. Keep your comments to yourself. You might as well spare yourself the carpal tunnel from banging on the keyboard too hard because I'm just going to delete your comment anyway. Um, other than that, peace.